Listen closely. If you don't separate yourself from your distractions, your distractions will separate you from your goals. So stay focused. First, I want to give thanks to Alexis for suggesting I make the Monster Mash from Rhino. Hey everybody, Rhino here, the world's strongest pro bodybuilder, back with another episode of Meals in a Minute. The Monster Mash. Looking at the ingredients, it has four simple ingredients. It's simple to make and Fucking boring, right? Let's go. Chicken stock. Short of that, this is the one to get. A lot of the others uh, have all those extra ingredients that I'm not a big fan of. So surprisingly, the chicken stock actually has a little bit more potassium than the beef stock. Ground bison from BJ's. Costco did not have any bison. Peppers and onions. Poof, 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 poof. There you go. And I'll pop that in there, and then I'll throw in a cup of rice, like so. And then I'll throw in about a cup of chicken stock. This is the ballpark. There's a few modifications I'm gonna do. I'm gonna, m it's still the same ingredients, it's still gonna be Monster Mash, but my own variation. We're gonna tweak it a little bit because I'm gonna make it my own way a little bit. It's still the same ingredients, but we're gonna make some, we're gonna adjust, we're gonna adjust it. We're going to adjust it, but we're going to adjust it. Yo. Didn't mention how he seasons the meat, but I'm assuming it's just simply salt and pepper, which I'm not gonna do, because since I'm Latino, since I'm Latino, you can probably guess what I'm bringing out. Adobo. You probably already know what I'm gonna, what I'm gonna be using. Goya. If you ever feel lazy, unmotivated, or discouraged, just remember the acronym G O Y A. Get off your ass. That's exactly what it means. Okay. You have no excuses. So no matter what, your nose bleeds, it's that time of the month, the kids are crying, you don't feel like it, your back hurts, you got aches and pains, it's still your motherfucking set. Let's get it done. Okay, get off your ass. That's what we're gonna be using. First, let's clean the meat to get rid of all the blood, that way it can bring out the flavor. So, watch. So first things first, instead of adding the chicken stock at the end when everything is done, I'm gonna be adding it to the pan so I can cook the ground beef and it comes out more juicy and brings out the flavor. This in combination with our adobo. This is gonna come out very flavorful, so let's check it out. Our chicken stock. Do -do 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 -do. That's well, enough. I was ask one of the, the other folks. That's that. enough. Pardon me, ma'am. I'm, I'm... Mm, While that's cooking, let's cut the peppers and onions.
To save time, I already have some cooked white rice, but there's no excuses. Because if you don't know how to cook white rice, there's a couple of options for you. You can get some 90 second white rice, pop that in the microwave, and that's it. We have that. We also have that. There's many different brands. 90 seconds, it's a game changer. 90 second rice, it's a game changer. My favorite is jasmine rice because it's soft and fluffy. You can also go to the Chinese store or Spanish restaurant and simply order a batch of white rice. So there's no excuses there. Go on Amazon, get yourself a box of 90 second rice or Costco, BJ's, get yourself a bulk order and you have all the white rice you need. Okay, so now let's throw in our onions and peppers. Check that out, wow, coming out beautiful. So far, what I'm liking about this Monster Mash, it's that it's simple and I can see why it's a bodybuilder's meal because it has three simple ingredients, rice, ground meat, and chicken stock. So the bison has 23 grams of protein for every four ounces and 11 grams of fat. You pair that with the rice and you have your carbs. So there's three perfectly portioned macros that you can eat at any time of the day for those gains, baby. So ground, you can use ground beef, ground lamb, it doesn't matter what ground meat it is because ground beef is easy to cook. So that's why it's so convenient. Two very boring minutes later. Okay, now the ingredients are together. And instead of mashing it, let's... Since we're in hurricane season, that's what we're doing. Boop, 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 What are you doing? And look at that. That is beautiful. Now that is packed with flavor. You saw how beautiful the ground beef is? That's how you do it. Bring out the flavor instead of using salt and pepper. Use adobo and all those ingredients that you got. Let's look at the sexiness. Wow. Now that I have this ready, I got this there, so immediately when I come out from the gym, I got my perfectly three macros so I can recover and rebuild muscle. So now it's time for my pre-workout. Beef protein with a banana, about 30 grams of carbs and 29 grams of protein. Perfect combination to provide me with sustained energy so I can power through the gym. Let's try this monster mash. 
see how it is. Oh. You, going, you going in the kitchen? Mm. Thank you, Jesus Christ, you for blessing me with this food. This, because it was so good, let's dance a little bit. Yeah. Panic one, a big tank zero. I'm sorry, did we get that on camera? How are you not dead? I have no idea. Do you see me dancing? Yes, I saw you dance. Is that all? So from one out of 10, I give it a 10. Well, my version at least. I'm telling you, adobo, Goya adobo is the shit. It's the shit. Yes, yes, oh yeah. Can you feel that, buddy? Huh, huh, huh? I have exercised the demons. That was the shit. Let's dance. Uh. <laughs> I love it, I love it, I love it, I love it. Wow. And there it is, the Monster Mash. Easy to eat, easy to digest, feels good on the stomach. I also take these with me on trips. I put them in Tupperware, take them on the plane, or I throw them in the freezer and I freeze them. I took six of them with me to Florida last week and I had meals for the whole time I was.